you guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. If you're new to my channel, I'm Akamsha. So, uh, a vlog again. Who am I? Back to back vlogs. I like doing this. I always wanted to do vlogs, but you know, something stopped me. But I'm you know, back to it. I really love doing it. I want you guys to get used to this. I tried to make myself look, look a little better, but it is still worse. I just worked out a while ago. I haven't even had food yet, so I don't have the energy. I'm trying and pretending to be like everything is fine. So put up with me. Uh, I have to do something. Like since COVID hit, it, it's been rough, and I feel like a lot of people are like into self care and stuff. And I was quite the opposite. I didn't do anything to make myself feel better, do better. And I'm really like yesterday. I was like. I need to do something. I just want to feel good. So I thought, you know, why not do like a whole um, grooming slash, you know, type of thing, if you know what I mean. Uh, so today I really want to get my hair cut. I call the salon which I always go to. It didn't answer, so hopefully they'll answer by the time I'm ready to go. It's been a lot of months. Like I think I got my hair cut in maybe September. I don't remember September, I guess. And it's been a while. Like and it grew out a lot. And I really want a hair cut. I really, really, really. really a haircut i don't know why i said really so many times but so first things first and i want to wash my hair actually the thought came uh, to you know do my hair is because i just did my workout and my hair is bad like today was leg day i sweat like crazy it's it's bad up there i'm like i need to wash my hair today but it's very lazy to wash my hair it's like okay if i go to the salon they'll wash the hair for me i don't have to wash it uh, and they'll blow dry it also for me so i don't have to do any uh, cast i'm like okay let's i mean Best thing to do is that I really want to get my hair colored as well, uh, but I was like, "There's time for that. I need to get like mentally prepared for that." So I'll just go take bath and then see where this day takes me. All right, I just took a shower. I feel much better already. If I took a hair wash, I would have felt a lot better. But it's coming. Just want to get it get clean with all the brows, the facial hair, etc. So I'm gonna tweeze and shave. Um. The first one always hurts so bad. It's like a prepping step for the next ones. Do you see like those tiny, tiny ones? Those are the ones that don't come out easily, and those are the ones which actually make it look like you know it has grown a lot. It's one of the really good tweezers I've tried. This is from a brand called Gub. It does like it tweezes even the tiniest hair, and I'm really enjoying this tweezer. So the hair removal part is done. Next, we are going to talk about today's sponsor, which is uh, Plum. Uh, I'm going to usually, like uh, always, like every time after I shave my face, I go in with the aloe vera gel. You can see, like you know, I tend to get really red. Uh, today it's very less, like, and I've shifted to a trimmer for that reason because uh, it's a lot sensitive on my skin while I'm shaving rather than a razor blade. But even then, you know, skin tends to get a little irritated, and I really like, you know, using uh, aloe vera. Gel to just calm your skin down post shaving. So this one from Plum is one of my favorite aloe vera gels. I just apply like a thick layer, especially here. I because here it's you can see how red it is. I just you know apply this and let my skin calm down a little bit. Bro, this is disgusting. <laughs> so my hand had hair from the thing, and I dipped my hand in the aloe vera gel, and the hair was dead. I removed it. So aloe vera has really good antioxidants. It has vitamin A and C. Aloe vera generally has multiple benefits, and it can be used for various different things. This one from Plum also can be used in various different things. You can see the texture. So when we talk about benefits for skin, it's used to treat sunburns. It's used to treat superficial acne, prevent dryness, and when it comes to hair. it calms itchy scalp it promotes hair growth it just hydrates your skin and hair in general i honestly really like this aloe vera gel my mom likes it too it doesn't smell weird it doesn't have any artificial color which is how it's supposed to be aloe vera is not supposed to be green green color like how people add a color and make it look like that it's you know how this you know this is the pure pure texture of aloe vera this one even has glycerin in it which is a humectant which basically hydrates your skin even more along with the, the aloe vera it has rose flower rose flower rose flower yes rose i have to invent a new flower it's called rose uh, anyways it has rose um, again it has rose flower 
extract so this one retails for rupees 399 for 250 grams of product it lasts for a really long time you can just apply it on your scalp directly you can apply it on your skin like i did just apply like you know thick layer of it on my skin so if you're looking for a really like good pure aloe vera gel then you can definitely give this one a try plum is an indian brand which is always a plus so uh, if you do want to check this product out then do check the description box i'll leave the link to it now I'm just going to let my skin stay for some time. I'll go have lunch. I'm very, very hungry. And, uh, you know, it'll be like, I have more one hour to go to the hair salon. So, and meanwhile, I'll just let my skin, you know, calm down before I add a little bit of makeup. I think I'm going to do makeup or I'll come back and do makeup. I've not decided yet, but for now, I'm very hungry. So, I'll go eat. So, by the way, the reason why I apply aloe vera like and on the entire face is firstly to calm the skin down and also prevent any inflammation, which may happen because, you know, I did run like a device on my skin and i don't want to irritate it first of all i have super sensitive skin so this just helps calm and soothe the skin hydrate it and you know it, i know for sure it won't give me any side effects because it's just aloe vera gel so this cutie just had her lunch tina in the now in the now hey chalo hi hi in just now she's playing with her coins this is her job every day just to transform this to that that to this chalo chalo ंग to go we are leaving uh, my sister in the house for the first time after a very long time i think since the pandemic hit we do not leave her at house and go anywhere even before that we used to never go anywhere like leaving her for longer period of times once in a while maybe for like one two hours we used to leave her because somebody always has to be there so today after a very long time i think it's almost a year that she was never home alone today she will be um my mom is First of all because it's a new house she's not understanding the alignment of stuff she doesn't know where the washroom is you know she she's not remembering stuff yet so um, it's like we have to guide her so if we leave her at home we don't know what to do but today there's nobody to take care usually it's like i go out and my mom is there mostly it is like that in more if she's not there then i'm there and uh, but today my mom doesn't want you guys to see her outfit but let's see if she comes out i'll give you a sneak peek She <laughs> came and she left. She doesn't want to show you guys. <laughs> I, I'm just waiting for my cab to come. So I want to take the before of my hair. So. Come on. cut is done all right so i'm back home i'm not going to show you my hair yet i'm running a little late i want to do my makeup very quickly and take a few pictures before the sun goes down it's already 5 o'clock and i am running pretty late you know we estimated the time it was wrong it took a lot longer in the salon than i expected so you know there's a little bit of things going on i really want to get ready though i just want to do some slight like very very soft um, glam i don't know where stuff is and when i'm late only you know everything has to get uh, more late i don't know why the lighting is so off in this there is so much life light around me i can see myself so well but i don't know why it's not there on the camera but the first things first i just i'm like you know i'll do very very soft glam very very soft like i'm telling you because i don't have time i want this to be over like in 10 minutes so the place i went to is jadhav habib like i know not like jadhav habib is great it depends on the 
people who are doing it so i get my hair cut at least the last three times i got my hair cut from a guy called bablu from that branch it's dilshanagar or musarambar branch in like for people in hyderabad who want to check it out this apparently was telling me you know there's this girl who saw the story i put previously and then um, you know she asked him that you know i know i know i follow her and he doesn't know that i do all the stuff like i don't talk to people usually when i go to places i'm just like i do my work and i come off look nobody knows me and that person nobody remembers so uh, he was asking like you know there was this girl like she also goes to him frequently and she was like you know really like her makeup and all that so sweet i thought doing a makeup in a hurry is such a task for me i cannot like I mean, I I I take my own time to do do makeup because it's like a feel good factor for me. But on some days, it's okay to go a little fast. I'm in love with this uh, Daughter Earth lip and cheek tint. It just adds such a flush, nice flush of color. And usually, you know, I've tried a lot of creme blushes like cheek tints, etc. Most of them, if not if not like completely, at least they tend to move around the foundation a little bit. But this one, you know, doesn't like move my foundation much. So that's the reason I really like this one. So we were actually really concerned to leave Pavlika and go, but you know she was fine. Usually the problem with her is uh, washroom. Uh, if she in case she has to go to the washroom, she does go sometimes. Most of the time she does she'll go and sit. But uh, the thing is she won't come out unless like someone cleans her up or washes her. And of course my like me and my mom are not not there. There's nobody to clean up. She sit in there for hours until we come back. So you know. that like one problem and if in case you know something wrong happens she cannot call anybody she cannot do anything so usually it's like my mom is on like red alert always i should have put on some lens are re i should have put on some lens to me i can try now it's just that i'm scared that i will ruin I, i'm for sure like i'll tear up and that person who like literally cries when they wear lens so I'm sure, like I'll ruin my under eye concealer or something, and I don't want to do that. Not able to find my Becca highlighter anywhere. But do how sad is it that Becca is shutting down? I I just read the like they announced it yesterday, and I was like, no, it's there's some beautiful products. It's so sad. It you know like. the scale of how uh, the pandemic has affected businesses is like really bad i can't even imagine bro what so okay makeup is done successfully it's time to decide the outfit thinking i'll wear this quad set i really want to wear this been so long i got this but i never wore it There's actually this uh, red dress also which I have which I never wore. Right, and actually both these dresses I never wore. So, huh? Now the decision. I think I'll wear this quad set. Actually, you know what? I, you know, I, I actually wear you know Western outfits every now and then, but it's been a while. I wore Indian, and I think it will make me feel a lot more better. So I just got a dress today. So this is from a page called Tashi Tashi Fashion. So yeah, I'm gonna wear Indian. Mm. Who, who thought the video is gonna turn out like this? But anyway, Indian just adds some kind of glow. So uh, all right, are you ready to see me? Uh, I love this neck piece, bro. Because the dress is so like simple, I thought I'll add like a statement necklace, and this looks beautiful. This is from a page called Trinkaholic on Instagram. I'll put the you know page in the description if you want to check it out. But bro, looks very nice. Like ignore my watch, but this dress is so pretty. Looks very nice, right? This is the bottoms. and this is how it looks it looks very very cute very very simple right decent but very like very colorful so my vibe i love how this looks it's that you know famous organza material of the patta which is going on i love how it fits as well usually don't like indian dresses especially which has like three fourth length on me but who knew this looks so good atlunde chindi chinda कोई मंचिंदा, एटलूंडी कोई
Oke. Bona kui? Eh, bona? Sai. Sai kat kundi. Ma, ni terusu ni ku sai kat kole nenu. Desa iskuna. Sai jadi desa ni apa? Desu. Desu. Bona kui? Jodoh jodoh. Bona. Daddy, Daddy, my dad is on video. <laughs> Daddy, Daddy. We dress as Kuni, Sarah, Mama, Mike, Sister, and Dressing Miss Sarah. You're the Me wearing Indian is miracle. And that was Nalama. Bana, dress as Kuni. Ini dah kerana macam cuma dulu. Hanshu. Hehehehe. 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 So yeah guys, I just like you know quickly shot one video, one reel so that I can post it because I really love like I didn't expect to wear Indian today, I didn't expect it to look this good also and the sun went down so I'm using like ring light and the difference between the before and after of these clips uh, but I just got done filming that also and I'll end the video with that it just feel really nice I'll post a vertical um, you know video on Instagram if you want to check that entire outfit I showed you pretty much the entire outfit uh, and it looks really really pretty and uh, yeah that's it for today's video and um, let me just show you my hair yeah, this is the hair. Like, there's not much difference. I just went in for a trim because it's been six months. I didn't cut a lot of length. It's just that he re-trimmed it. He did multi-layers. If you want to check out the salon where I went to, I'll leave that also in the description. If you wish, uh, he went in with multi-layers. That's what he said. And um, this is how they look. Previously, also, I had multi-layers. So, basically, just trimmed all those uh, uh, grown-out ends and... Uh, it looks like this now. I really like how it looks. Hair color, I'm not sure when I'm going to get, but for now, this is that's which I feel really good because I wore Indian literally after years. Like I'm, I'm, I'm telling you, really, really years. Like with this heavy jewelry, etc. Uh, with that, we end this video. I hope you enjoyed watching. If you did, then make sure like, share, and subscribe to my channel, and ring the notification bell. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Like the feeling of new hair.